I think we've found a scientific answer for the meaning of life, if you're that way inclined. Neuroscientist, mathematician, physicist, and general whiz kid Carl Friston has come up with what he calls the free energy principle. The free energy principle is a detailed mathematical framework to understand the basis of all life. The mathematics is not something I understand, but the general idea I think I've got a grip on. But first, there is a story from Anil Seth, another neuroscientist, about when he first heard about the free energy principle. He was late for a conference, and he really wanted to see what Carl Friston was bringing. But he arrived just after Friston had finished his speech. Apparently, Friston explained the entire free energy principle, got up and walked away. And the crowd erupted into chaos. An entire conference of the most academically intelligent people you could collect were absolutely mind-blown by what Friston had just shared. And very few of them understood what he meant. Friston took no questions. The man seems pretty autistic to me, to be honest. The most basic premise I can understand is that living things are living things because they seek to resist the entropy of the universe. Entropy obviously being a pretty big deal in a universal sense. And the way they do this is by minimizing free energy. I still don't know what the hell that means. But it is analogous to an ability to minimize unpredictable variables from the outside world. The better you can predict these unpredictable variables, also known as surprisal, the better you can survive. And this is done by building internal models of the external world. For very simple single cellular or multicellular life, this may be a chemical balance. For us, it is exponentially more complicated. But at the heart of it, the way to survive is to build better models of reality. That is what we have been doing since the first inceptions of life on this planet. That is what we are still trying to do. And we as humans have the unique ability to do this collectively. That is the meaning of our lives, to build better models together.